Thank you for that kind introduction. It's certainly uh, a pleasure to join with you this morning. Uh, first, I want to acknowledge Margaret Bazell, what a great leader she is. During my days with Briarcliff College, I actually was a member here, served as a sponsor, and uh, spent a lot of time here during the dot-com days, before the dot-bomb days came. And I uh, just want to acknowledge Margaret, one wonderful, wonderful person, ACIT. The great work that you do. Uh, good morning and thank you for inviting me here today. Uh, as we face these challenging economic times, it's uh, crucial to focus our energy on rebuilding our uh, local economy here and foster a more business-like environment. Our community is feeling the negative impact of a poor economy. This is why we cut the cost of government and provided our residents and businesses in Nassau County tax relief. Instead of raising property taxes, I chose to cut the cost of Nassau County government. Operating government today in Nassau County, we operate with 610 fewer budgeted positions, thereby reducing the uh, employee headcount in Nassau County to the lowest levels since the 1950s. We cut over $171 million in wasteful government spending, consolidated departments, stopped a $34 million lease giveaway, saved millions of dollars in energy costs, and are forming a purchasing consortium to save tax dollars. Our first consortium action alone saved 22% on the cost of paper. And believe me, government uses a lot of paper. The budget I submitted achieved $55 million in labor savings. To further help the business sector, I reformed Nassau County's broken property tax assessment system that for over a decade resulted in unfair and uncertain assessments. Businesses will now have certainty through a four-year frozen assessment and also have the opportunity to settle grievances before paying their tax bill. Knowing that the business sector is the lifeblood of Nassau County's economy, I am doing everything possible to improve our economic climate. And if you have suggestions, please call my office. We have a business advisory council that meets regularly, provides input, and we are taking action in Nassau County. Uh, since taking office, I've assembled a team of economic development experts in our office from economic development who have revitalized Nassau County's IDA. This year, IDA issued $5 million of recovery zone facility bonds to induce a local real estate developer to rehabilitate a blighted and empty industrial building and to convert it to a first-class office space. The project will result in the creation of jobs and opportunities for residents as well as jobs for the construction trade. The IDA also helped Grumman Studios find favorable financing to purchase land, renovate the existing 660,000 square feet foot building, and acquire and install necessary machinery, fixtures, and equipment. Movies are now being filmed here on a regular basis. Movies like Salt, the major motion picture starring Angelina Jolie, was mostly filmed here in Nassau County. Other movies and television shows filmed in the county in 2010 were White Collar, Gossip Girl, Boardwalk Empire, Wall Street 2, Win Win, Rescue Me, and Dark Horse. Together, the film and television industry has uh, resulted in over $75 million being spent in our local economy, as well as producing sales tax revenue for our county. Another job created can be found in Homeland Defense. I'm thrilled that the Morelli Homeland Security Center, the first of its kind in the nation, brings government, defense contractors, local businesses together to develop tomorrow's security technology and composite manufacturing today here on Long Island in Nassau County. With this center, we have the ability to create jobs and opportunities to address the brain drain here in Nassau County. We need to right-size government so people can afford to live, work, and raise a family here. This is my mission. I look forward to working with you to accomplish our mutual goal to create jobs and opportunities for our generation and future generations. Thank you very much.